make us worthy to pray thankfully our Father who art in heaven. Trinity, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, peace and the edification for the one only holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. Remember, O Lord, those brought to you this gift, those on whose behalf they have been brought, those by whom they have been brought. Give them all heavenly reward for this holy and precious gift. Sacrifice it and those who brought them, Lord, have mercy. Alleluia, five people, choice, Blessed be God the Father, the Vandukrator. Blessed be His only begotten Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the power of Nevmati, ke 
ενήν και αή και στο σε όνα στον αιώνα. Αμήν. Let us give thanks to the beneficent and merciful God, Father of our Lord, God and Savior Jesus Christ, for he has covered us, helped us, guarded us, accepted us to himself, spared us, supported us, and has brought us us to this hour let us also ask him the lord our god the pentecostal to guard us in all peace this holy day all the days of our life <laughs> Master, Lord God, the Pandukrator, Father of our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ, we thank you for everything concerning everything and in everything. You have covered us, helped us, guarded us, accepted us to yourself, spared us, supported us, and have brought us to this hour. Grace of God, have mercy and compassion on us. Hear us, help us, and accept the meditation and prayer for sent for that which is good on our behalf at all time. And make us worthy to partake of the communion of his holy and blessed mystery for the remission of our sins. Lord have mercy. Therefore, we ask and entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind. Grant us to complete this holy day, all the days of our life, in all peace with you, feel all envy, all temptation, all the work of Satan, counsel of wicked men raising up of enemies, hidden and manifest, take them away from us, from all your people, from this holy state that is yours. But those things which are good and profitable to provide for us, you have given us the authority to tread on serpents and scorpions, upon all the power of the enemy. So servant, the minister of this day, my fathers, my brethren, my weak self be absolved from the mouth of the Holy Trinity, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, from the mouth of the one only Holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God, from the mouth of the twelve apostles and the beholder of God, Evangelist and Mark, the Holy Martyr, the Petrus and Sawirus, our teacher, Dioscorus, Saint Asanasius the Apostolic, Saint Peter, Holy Martyr and High Priest, St. John Chrysostom, St. Cyril, St. Basil, St. Gregory, from the mouth of 318 assembly at Nicaea, 
150 at Constantinople and 200 at Ephesus. From the mouth of our father, the high priest, Pope Tawadro II, our father, the bishop, and Bakaras, and my weak self, glory, honor, beauty, your father, son, and Holy Spirit, now forever, unto the age of ages. Amen. Saints 
servant of our Lord Jesus Christ. Sorry, be seated at Fadal Ustareha. Just to want to, to direct our minds to two things. Today, instead that we listen, we did not s s f start the Holy Land, but all the reading today and tomorrow will be from the book of the Holy Land. And we call them the reading of the Saturday of the pre-Lent and Sunday of the pre-Lent. And today you're going to find the deacon chanting the hymns half in the annual tone and half in the Holy Lent tone. Just uh, to remind us that the Holy Lent is coming and we have to be ready for that. So the reading today, instead that we are celebrating the, uh, the feast or the commemoration of St. John the Baptist and Bob Quirolos the sixth today. But because we started the pre-Lent reading, the reading will not be on the feast of um, St. John, but for the reading of the pre-Lent. Okay, so you're gonna find the reading today and tomorrow how can you be ready for the Holy Land? And he's gonna give us many things to prepare us and the priority. To repent, to uh, offer, and uh, to forgive, and to pray. That's, that will be the arrangement of the reading. So I hope that all can focus on the reading today. Go ahead, Fadl Joseph. Paul, the servant of our Lord Jesus Christ, called to be an apostle, appointed to the gospel of God, a reading from the second epistle of our teacher Paul to the Corinthians. May his holy blessings be with us. Amen. Do not be unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship has righteousness with lawlessness? And what communion has light with darkness? And what accord has Christ with Belial? Or what part has a believer with an unbeliever? And what agreement has the temple of God with idols? For you are the temple of the living God. As God has said, I will dwell in them and walk among them. I will be their God, and they shall be my people. Therefore, come out from among them and be separate, says the Lord. Do not touch what is unclean, and I will receive you. I will be a father to you, and you shall be my sons and daughters, says the Lord Almighty. Therefore, having these promises, beloved, let us cleanse ourselves from the filthiness of the flesh and the spirit, perfecting holiness in the fear of God. Open your hearts to us. We have wronged no one. We have corrupted no one. We have cheated no one. I do not say this to condemn, for I have said before that you are in our hearts to die together and to live together. Great is my boldness of speech toward you. Great is my boasting on your behalf. I am filled with comfort. I am exceedingly joyful in all our tribulation. For indeed, when we came to Macedonia, our bodies had no rest, but we were troubled on every side. Outside were conflicts, inside were fears. Nevertheless, God who comforts the downcast com comforted us by the coming of Titus. And not only by his coming, but also by the consolation with which he was comforted in you when he told us of your earnest desire, your mourning, your zeal for me so that, in, so that I rejoiced even more. For even if I made you sorry with my letter, I do not regret it, though I did regret it. For I, I perceive that the same epistle made you sorry though only for a while. Now I rejoice, not that you were made sorry, 
but that your sorrow led to repentance, for you were made sorry in a godly manner, that you might suffer loss from us in nothing. For godly sorrow produces repentance, leading to salvation, not to be regretted, but the sorrow of the world produces death. For observe this very thing that you sorrowed in a godly manner, what diligence it produced in you, what clearing of yourselves, what indignation, what fear, what vehement desire, what zeal, what vindication. In all things you proved yourself to be clear in this matter. Therefore, though I wrote to you, I did not do it for the sake of him who had done the wrong, nor for the sake of him who suffered wrong, but that our care for you in the sight of God might appear to you. Therefore, we have been comforted in your comfort, and we rejoiced exceedingly more for the joy of Titus, because his spirit has been refreshed by you all. For if in anything I have boasted to him about you, I am not ashamed. But as we spoke all things to you in truth, even so our boasting to Titus was found true. And his affections are greater for you as he remembers the obedience of you all, how with fear and trembling you received him. Therefore, I rejoice that I have confidence in in you in everything. The grace of God the Father be with you all. Amen. Stoli, 
انت فنيوت بتروسنا من راتي بيتروس اف ابوستولوس انت ايسوس في خريستوس اني صوت تشوب هي ابشي مونخريخن في قريفول انت بونتوب اووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووووو
of our fathers, the pure apostles, who were invested with the grace of the Holy Spirit, may their blessing be with us all. Amen. Now it came to pass that when we had departed from them and set sail, running a straight course, we came to Kos. The following day to Rhodes, and there and from there to, to Patara. And finding a ship sailing over to Phoenicia, we went aboard and set sail. When we had sighted Cyprus, we passed it on the left, sailed to Syria, and landed at Tyre. For there the ship was to unload her cargo. And finding disciples, we stayed there seven days. They told Paul through the Spirit not to go to Jerusalem. When we had come to the end of those days, we departed and went on our way. And they all accompanied us, the wives and the children till we were out of the city. And we knelt down on the shore and prayed. When we had taken our leave of one another, we boarded the ship and they returned home. And when we had finished our voyage from Tyre, we came to Ptolemais, greeted the brethren and stayed with them one day. On the next day, we who were Paul's companions departed and came to Caesarea and entered the house of Philip the Evangelist, who was one of the seven, and stayed with him. Now this man had four virgin daughters who prophesied. Prophes prophesied. And as we stayed many days, a certain prophet named Ag Agabus came down from Judea. When he had come to us, he took Paul's belt, bound his own hands and feet, and said, Thus says the Holy Spirit, so shall the Jews at Jerusalem bind the man who owns this belt, and deliver him into the hands of the Gentiles. Now when we heard these things, both we and those from that place pleaded with him not to go up to Jerusalem. Then Paul answered, What do you mean by weeping and breaking my heart? For I, am not re for I am not ready not only to be bound, but also to die at Jerusalem for the name of the Lord Jesus. So when he would not be persuaded, we ceased saying, The will of the Lord be done. The word of the Lord shall grow, multiply, be mighty, and be confirmed in the Holy Church of God. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit, one God. Amen. Today is the last day of the Coptic month, Amshir. May God end it in goodness, renewed for peace, tranquility, our sins forgiven. Through the tender mercy of our Lord, my fathers and my brethren. Amen. On this day, we celebrate the appearance of uh, the head of St. John the Baptist in Homs, Syria, Saint John appeared to Abba Martianus, Bishop of Homs in the vision, and guided him to the wear about the head. He founded and celebrated its appearance with a great veneration. The story of a journey of the head of Saint John the Baptist started when Herod cut off his head, his holy head, because of his marriage to Herodias. It was said that after the feast, he regretted the beheading of St. John. So he did the holy, high, holy 
head in his house. The place of the hidden head was unknown for a long time until two Christian people or men from Homs came to Jerusalem during the holy fast to receive the blessing of the holy places. Night fell on them while passing by Herod's palace. They were spent the night nearby. St. John appeared to one of them and told him about his name, informed him about the place of his head and ordered him to take it to his house. When they wake up, they dug in the place and the sand, the sand specified for them. They found the holy head in a pottery vessel. When they opened, a sweet aroma came out of it. The man was so who saw the vision, took it to his house. He lit a lamp in front of it after the departure of this man. The head was handed down from one person to another in the city of Homs. St. John appeared to Appa Martianus, Bishop of Homs, in the later part of the fourth century and guided him to the place of the head. He found the head took it and celebrated with a great feast. The blessing of uh, St. John the Baptist be with us all, amen. On this day also of the year 1687 of the martyrs, March 9, 1971 AD, the Holy and Righteous Father, Abba Kirolos VI, the 116th Pope of Alexandria departed. He was born in the city of Damanhur to godly and righteous parents. His name was Azar Yusuf Atta. The Hegumin Tedros El Baramusi, an elder monk, used to frequently visit them. He foretold his monastic life. When he grew, he practiced the monastic life at home, preserving in studying the holy books, church subjects, its rituals and humans and hymns, in July 1927, he went to the monastery of El Baramus, where he became a monk by the name Mina El Baramusi. On July 18, 1931, he was ordained a priest. He joined the seminary at Helwan when he heard that Pope Ioannis, the 113 patriarch, intended to ordain him a bishop. He fled to Upper Egypt and stayed in San Chinuda Monastery in Suhag. He returned later on and met the patriarch who agreed to his request of solitary life and assigned a pious monk, Hugemen Abdel Messih al Baramusi, to be his spiritual guide. Then he lived in a cave one hour walking distance from the monastery. He only came to the monastery Saturday night to take care of the elder monks attend Vespers and Sunday liturgy to partake of the holy ministries. Early in 1936, he lived a deserted mill on the Mukatta Mount in Old Cairo, where he diligently held a daily liturgy. In 1941, he was assigned to be the abbot of Amba Samuel, the confessor monastery in Kalamon Mont. He renovated the monastery, the church, and built new cells for the monks. The church was consecrated by the late Bishop Amba Athanasius of Venezuela, who gave him the rank of Hegumen. In 1947, he returned to Old Cairo, where he built the church after the name of San Mina. In that church, several pious monks became his disciples. Many of them later on became bishops of the church. Because of his perpetual prayers and strong faith, he healed the sick, cast out evil spirits, and solved many problems for his visitors. When Pope Yuseb II departed, and after the long process of nominations, the elections were concluded and an altar lot was drawn, the Kuriyat Hugemen Mina El Baramusi was chosen to be the 116th Pope of Alexandria. His consecration took place on Sunday, May 10th, 1959, as Pope Cyril VI. In June 28, 1959, 
He consecrated the patriarch Catholic cause for the Ethiopian church to strengthen the ties between the sister churches. In November 1959, Pope Kirolos put the foundation stone of the monastery of the martyr Mary Mina, the wonder worker in the wilderness of Mariut, and relocated his pure lilacs to it. In 1967, Pope Kirolos compounded the Holy Myron, which was a historical occasion since this was only done 26 times in the history of the Coptic Church. In April 2nd, 1968, the Immaculate Mother of God, St. Mary, was transfigurated on the dooms of her church in Zaytun. And in June 1968, Pope Kirolos received the relics of St. Mark after sojourning away from Egypt for close to 11 centuries. He laid it to rest in a reliquary specially built under the altar of the great cathedral of St. Mark which Pope Kirolos built in the area of Amber Ways, El Abbasia. This cathedral was inaugurated in a magnificent celebration attended by then President Nasser and the late Emperor Hail Selassie and delegates from the churches all over the world. Pope Kirolos never forgot that he is the poor monk Mina, the Ancoriot. His food was very simple. Many days he would subsist subsist on a meal of dry bread, salt, and cumin after the late divine liturgies, which concluded in the evening. He was diligent in singing midnight praise daily. His daily liturgy was serene and profound. God has accorded this pure father the gift of working great miracles even after his departure. When God wanted to give him rest from the afflictions of this present age, he had a brief illness, and on the day of his departure, he received a number of his children. He raised the cross and said, May the Lord arrange your affairs. Then he delivered his pure soul into the hands of God, whom he served and loved. On November 25, 1972, his pure relics were relocated to the monastery of St. Mina at Mariut, according to his handwritten will. On the day of the relocation of his relics, heaven honored him by the sky thundered and rain came down in such a way that had never been seen before. The blessing of the prayers of this Holy Father be with us all and glory be to our God forever. Amen. <laughs> Misen emmanu il entok o Mishti khenni esoweb Tiro yu ennis birebti o oms Ari ebrez vebi
Oso ek parteno genetis eleisonimes Agios oteos, agios esheros Agios atanatos, ostabrotis dimes eleisonimes Mercy upon us, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of the ages. Amen, O Holy Trinity, have mercy upon us. Get up, Nevmati. So, Master Lord Jesus Christ, our God, said to his saintly honored disciples and holy apostles, many prophets and righteous men, desire to see things you see and have not seen them, and to hear things you hear and have not hear them for you blessed are your eyes for they see and your ears for they hear may we be worthy to hear and to act according to your holy gospels through the prayer of your saints pray for the holy gospel lord have mercy remember also master those bidden us to remember them in our prayer supplication we offer to you O lord our god those who have already fallen asleep repose them those who are sick heal them and hayatuna kullina Raga'una kullina, khalasuna kullina, shifa'una kullina, wa qiyamitna kullina. Sitte metavo buatheo cosme tu agio evangelion. Tu smar oten je vetneyo khane vrane me pcho iskiri evloge son katalo kana ge evangelio tu ana gnozme. in the fear of God and listen to the Holy Gospel a reading from the Gospel according to our teacher Saint Luke may his blessing be with us all amen from the song of our teacher David the prophet May his holy be with us all, amen. O oh, come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us shout joyfully to the rock of our salvation. Let us come before his presence with thankfulness. Let us shout joyfully to him with song. At the scene, some who told him about the Galileans, who blood pilots had mingled with their sacrifices. And Jesus answered and said to them, Do you, sup 
Do you suppose to do you suppose that these Galileans were worse sinners than all of the Galileans because they suffered such things? I tell you, no, but unless you repent, you will all likewise perish. Or those eating on whom the tower of Siloam fell and killed them, do you think that they were worse sinners than all of other men who dwelt in Jerusalem? I tell you no, but unless you repent, you will all likewise perish. بل إن لم تتوبوا فجميعكم هكذا تهلكون In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit, one God, Amen. Today, uh, as we said, we celebrating the start of the Holy Land. And today the church started to give us the reading of the Holy Land. Today we have what we call the Saturday of the pre-Land. احنا ابتدينا في قرايات الصوم الكبير. الكنيسة بحكمتها يوم الرفاع السبت والحد بتبتدي قرايات الصوم الكبير. To make all of us ready and to be prepared for the Holy Land. The message today the church chose for us chapter uh, part from chapter number 13 from the book of Luke and the Lord repeated a verse number three and number five the same he said I tell you unless you repent you will like all likewise perish in lam tatubu gami'ukum kathalika tahlakum so the message is very clear the Lord out of his love out of his mercy he gave all of us this season to be a season of repentance. This time is the time of repentance. So what is the meaning of repentance? Repentance in the Orthodox faith and the Orthodox understanding, it has two wings. Number one, to be happy with God, happy with him. And number two, to be sorrow with our deeds and examining our deeds. إن إحنا بندعى إليها في هذا الصوم في الفكر الأرثوذكسي ليها معنيين إن أنا أشوف ربنا وأبقى فرحان بقوته وأشوف ضعفي وأبقى صعبان علي الضعف اللي أنا فيه To prove this not just see what we received today in the psalm Come, let us sing to the Lord It is not a season of weeping only You will not be able to examine yourself unless you know the power of God so let us come, let us sing to the Lord, let us shout joyfully to the rock of our salvation. Let us come before his presence with thanksgiving. Let us shout joyfully to him without, without psalms. Sorry. So because of that, the church is giving us today this part to be ready to receive the uh, the Lent in this way. And also because we are today preparing ourselves for the Holy Land, so the church chose us in the book of Acts what happened by the last mission trip of St. Paul, the third mission trip. St. Paul finished his third mission trip and came to Caesarea, going to Jerusalem. In every church, the Holy Spirit prophesied and he directed that St. Paul going to be arrested and going to be killed. So many people, they asked St. Paul not to go to Jerusalem. So what happened? While St. Paul was in Caesarea, he says, one of the prophets of Jerusalem came to the church of Caesarea. When he had come to us, he took Paul's belt, bound his own hands and feet, and he prophesied. Said the Holy Spirit, 
Shall the Jews at Jerusalem bind the man who owned this spilt and deliver him into the hands of the Gentiles? So when the people in the church knew that they asked, they begged St. Paul, asked him not to go to Jerusalem. So what happened with St. Paul? Now when he, we heard the things, both we and those from that place pleaded with him not to go up to Jerusalem. His friends, his fellows, his, the church of Caesarea, all of them, they bowed. They asked St. Paul, please don't go. We need you. We need your service. You need your ministry. But St. Paul said something amazing. He said, Paul answered, what do you mean by weeping and breaking my heart? I am ready. And the church should choose this part today because of that. St. Paul said, I am ready. Ana mustahid. I am ready not only to be bound, but also to die Jerusalem for the sake of the Lord Jesus himself. question. St. Paul, he said, I am ready. So what about all of us? Can we say today, I'm ready. I'm ready for the Holy Land. I'm ready for this Holy season. I'm ready to be close to the Lord Jesus. I am ready to start repenting. I'm ready to examine myself. I'm ready to live according to the pattern, according to the style of the Lord Jesus Christ. I am I'm singing to the Lord. I'm happy with my Lord because he's going to accept me. He is not only the Almighty, he is my Father. And sometimes the Lord may give us to suffer just to be ready. So to conclude, let us say what we received today in the book of St. Paul, verse number 9 and verse number 8. He says, I rejoice not that you were made sorry, but that your sorrow led to repentance. Sometimes the Lord may accept, may, may allow us to go through hard times. Why? To be ready. To be ready and to be joyful in him. So because of that, because of that, he said in verse number, sorry. He said in, in verse number 10, Godly sorrow produces repentance leading to salvation. الحزن الذي بحسب مشيئة الله ينشئ توبة لخلاص بلا ندامة أما حزن العالم فينشئ موت Sometimes the Lord allow us to go to hard times to feel sorry just to help us to go back to him and to be ready for the Holy Land We're gonna, we're gonna start the Holy Land this Monday I'm not marketing to the Holy Land I'm not marketing to the Holy Land I'm not asking anyone to fast. But let us see that the church is giving us this time not to be يعني, struggling with, with different types of food, but it is, it is a season for our spirits to come close to God. So I am praying that everyone today in this liturgy say, I'm ready. I'm not asking you to be extreme. If you are not able to fast, you have any any medications or any uh, situation, medical situation, don't come يعني, to, to fast, when to, يعني, don't pressure yourself. But I'm asking God to open our hearts, our minds, so we're going to see this season as a season of repentance, as a season of coming to God, as a season of, of being like Christ. Even if we are going through hard times, this hard time will guide us to come to him. So I encourage all of you to start from, not from today, not from tomorrow, but from Monday. Number two, I am asking all of you to start reading the Bible regularly as a church. We're going to read the book of Acts. We're going to read the uh, St. Paul and uh, Epistles to the Roman, to the Hebrews, to Galatia. I'm asking you to read the book of the paradise of the spirit that we shared. Have time every day to pray your Psalms to read the Bible, to examine yourselves, to come close to God, to try to practice uh, fasting with the absolute fasting, and then to arrange your schedule to find time to come to the 
Holy Lent liturgies. So it will be a season of coming close to him. Be happy that our Lord is accepting us whatever our situation. And also be serious examining ourselves to be ready for this holy season and to suffer with the Lord and to be resurrected with him. كل سنة وأنتم طيبين. الصوم الكبير مش مش هنقعد نسوق له نقول يا ريت نصوم وما نصومش. بس يا رب يتفتح عينينا الشعب كلنا على البركة اللي موجودة في هذه الأيام. ما يكونش زي ما بيقول معلمنا داوود النهارده لنفرح بالرب لنرتل له. ما يكونش الصيام بس مركزين على الجسد لكن نشوف مراحم الله اللي عايزة تغفر. ومراحم الله اللي عاوزه تشفي ومراحم الله اللي عاوزه تغير واللي عاوزه تقبل واللي عاوزه تستر ونقرب لربنا في هذا الخشوع ونقول له زي ما هنسمع بقى في الايام الجايه لست مستحق ان ادعى لك ابنا اجعلني كاحد ايه؟ كاحد اجراك يقول لك اجراك مين؟ تعالى ابني هذا كان ايه؟ كان ميتا فعاش وكان ضالا فوجد من اجمل ايام الكنيسه ايام الصوم ربنا قادر انه يجعلها ايام بركه وايام صيام وايام توبه لكل الشعب لالهنا كل مجد وكرامه من الان والى الابد امين We believe in one God, God the Father, Panchukator, Creator of heaven and earth, and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten not created, of one essence with the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men for our salvation came down from heaven was incarnate of the Holy Spirit, of the Virgin Mary, and became man. He was crucified for us and punished Pilate, for the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, who the Father and Son is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets, and in one holy Catholic apostolic church, we confess from baptism for remission of sins. We look for the resurrection of the dead, and the life of the age to come. Amen. 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 Get up, so oh God, the great, the eternal, who formed man in corruption and death entered into the world through the envy. You have destroyed by the life-giving manifestation of your only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior, 
Jesus Christ, who has filled the earth with the heavenly peace by which the host of angels glorify you, saying, Glory to God in the highest, peace on earth, and good will toward me. Pray for perfect peace, love, and the Holy Apostle greeting. Lord, have mercy. According to your good will, O God, fill our hearts with your peace. Cleanse us from all blemish, all guile, all hypocrisy, all malice, craftness, and vizering death. Make all worthy master to greet one another with a holy kiss. Without casting us into condemnation, we may partake of your immortal and heavenly gift in Christ Jesus. Our Lord. Greet one another with a holy kiss. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Yes, Lord, who is Jesus Christ, the Son of God, hear us and have mercy upon us. Offer, offer, offer. Stand with trembling, look towards the east, let us attend. Through the intercessions of the Theotokos and Mary, O oh Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. We worship you, O oh Christ, with your good Father and the Holy Spirit, for you have come and saved us. A mercy of peace, a sacrifice of of praise Lord be with you and with your upon the lowly who has created the heaven, the earth, the sea, and all that is therein, the Father of our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ. By you may have created all things visible and invisible, who is seated upon the throne of his glory, and who is worshipped by all the holy powers. You who are seated stand before whom stand the angels, the archangels, the principalities, the authorities, the thrones, the dominions, and the powers. 
Look towards the east. أنت هو الذي يخف حولك الشعر ويمتلون عيونا والسرافيم زو الستة الأجنحة يسبحون على الدوام بغير سكوت قائل رسخومن الشروبيم يسجدون لك والسرافيم يمجدوا نك صارخين قائلين كودوس 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 رب الصباوت السماء والأرض مملؤتان من مجد greatest and places in the paradise of joy and when we disobeyed your commandment by the deceit of the serpent we fell from eternal life and were exalted from the paradise of joy you have not abandoned us unto the end but have always with us through holy prophets and in the last days you manifested yourself to us who are sitting in darkness and the shadow of death, through your only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ, who of the Holy Spirit and of the Holy Virgin, same may. Amen. And taught us the ways of salvation. He grant us birth from on high through the war and spirit. He made us unto himself an assembled people and sanctified us by your Holy Spirit. He loved his own who in the world and as a ransom on our behalf gave himself up to death which reigned over us whereby we were bound and sold on account of our sins. He descended into Hades through the cross. Amen. from the dead on the third day ascended into heaven the 
Jesus sat at your right hand, O Father. He has appointed a day for recompense on which you will appear to judge the world in righteousness and give each one according to their deeds. According to your mercy, O Lord, and not according to our sins. This great mystery of God is being determined to give Himself up to death for the life of the world. We believe. He took bread into his holy hand, which are without spot or blemish, blessed and life-giving. We believe that this is true. Amen. Heaven to you, Father, Master of everyone, you have given time. He placed them, sanctified to his saintly disciples and holy apostles, saying, Take it of it, all of you. This is my body, which is broken for you and for many to be given for the remission of sin. Do this in remembrance of me. This is true. Amen. Likewise also the cup after supper, mix it with wine water. He have given thanks. Amen. He blessed them. Amen. He sanctified them. to his saintly disciples and holy apostles saying take drink of it all of you this is my blood of the new covenant which is shed for you and for many to be given for the remission of sin do this 
in remembrance of, of me. This is all so true. Every time you eat of this bread, you drink of this cup, you proclaim my death, confess my resurrection, you remember me till I come. Amen, 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 your death, O Lord, we proclaim your holy resurrection. from the dead, his ascension to heaven, sitting at your right hand. O Father, his second coming from heaven, O Zaman, full of glory, we offer to you your gift from what is your for everything concerning everything and everything. Worship God in fear and trembling. We praise you, we bless you, we serve you, we worship you. Oh, 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 oh. into his holy body. I believe Amen. Amen. This cup also the precious blood of his new covenant. Again, I believe to those who partake of him. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Gana mustaqeen kullana ya sayyidna natana wal muqudsatika taratan lanfusna aksana arwahana. لكي نكون جسدا واحدا وروحا واحدا ونجد نصيبا وميراثا مع جميع القديسين الذين أردوك منذ البعد اذكر يا رب سلام كنيستك الواحدة الوحيدة المقدسة الجامعة الرسولية Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. Lord have mercy. This which you have acquired to yourself with the precious blood of your Christ, keep her in peace with all the Orthodox bishops who are in her. Foremost, remember, O Lord, our blessed and honored Father, the Archbishop, our Patriarch, Abba Tawadrus the second and his partner in the apostolic liturgy, our honored father, the bishop Abba Kaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
صلوا من اجل رئيس كانتنا البابا انبا تودرس الثاني بابا بطرايك ورئيس عصقبه المدينه العظمه الاسكندريه وشريكه في الخدمه الرسوليه ابينا الاسقف المكرم من انبا كراس وسائر ساقفاتنا الارثوذكسيين يا رب الذين يفصلون معه كلمة الحق باستقامة أنا من بما لكن استقل مقدس أرى ونقطعك بسلام أذكر يا رب القمامسة والقصوص الأرثوذكسيين والشمامسة Pray for the Hegemans, priests, deacons, subdeacons, and the seven orders of the Church of God Lord have mercy all the servants and all who are in virginity and the purity of your faithful people. Remember, O oh Lord, to have mercy upon us all. Have mercy upon us, O oh God the Father, the Pantokra. salvation of this year holy place and every place and every monastery of our orthodox fathers sallu min ajl az khalas az al alam wa waditna haza wa sa'ir al mudan wa laqalim wa jazair wa la diura ya rab أذكر يا رب خلاص هذا الموضع المقدس graciously accord O Lord to bless the seeds of the herbs of the plants that they feel this year pray for the seeds and the herbs and the plants of the field this year that Christ our God may bless them to grow and multiply into perfection with great fruit, have compassion on his creation, which his hands have made, and forgive us our sins. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Praise them to their measure according to your grace, give joy to the face of the earth. May the purest viewers be abundantly water and fruits be plentiful. Prepare it for sowing and harvesting. Manage our life as deemed fit. Bless the crown of the year with your goodness. For the sake of the poor of your people, the widow, the orphan, the traveler, the stranger. And for the sake of all of us, entreat you and seek your holy name. For the eyes of everyone wait upon you, for you give them their food in due season. Deal with us according to your goodness, O you good food to all flesh. Fill our hearts with joy and gladness, that we too having sufficiency in everything always may abound in every good deed. have brought you these gifts, those on whose behalf they have been brought, and those by whom they have been brought. Give them all the heavenly reward. Pray for this holy precious gifts our sacrifices and those who brought them. Lord, have mercy. As this, O Lord, is the command of your only begotten Son, that we share in the commemoration of your sins. Graciously accord, O Lord, remember all the saints who have pleased you since the beginning. Our holy fathers, 
the patriarchs, the prophets, the apostles, the preachers, the evangelists, the martyrs, the confessors, and all the spirits of the righteous, perfect thing in faith, and most of all the pure, full of glory, ever virgin, the holy Theotokos, who truly gave birth to God the Logos, and St. John, the forerunner, the Baptist and martyr, St. Stephen, the archdeacon and proto-martyr, the beholder of God, the evangelist St. Mark, the holy apostle and martyr, the patriarch St. Severus, our teacher Dioscoro, St. Athanasius, the apostle, St. Peter, the holy martyr and archpriest, St. John Chrysostom, St. Theodosius, St. Theophilius, St. Demetrius, St. Cyril, St. Basil, St. Gregory, the theologian, St. Gregory, the wonder worker, and St. Gregory, the Armenian, the 300 that he assembled at Nicaea, the 150 at Constantinople, and the 200 at uh, Ephesus, our righteous Father, the great of Antony, the righteous of Paul, the three saints of Macari, and all their children across bearers, our Father of John the Higumen, our righteous Father of Apishoi, the perfect man, the beloved of our good saint. Savior, our father of Apollo of Tammu, and Ezekiel, his disciple, my lords, the Roman fathers, Maximus and Dumedius, the 49 martyrs, the elders of Shehid, the strong saint of Moses, and John Cameron, the priest. Our father of Daniel the Higumen, our father of Isidore the priest, our father of Abahum of Kinonia and Theodore his disciple, our father of Ashinuti the archman at right, and of Awisa his disciple, and all the choir of your saints through whose prayers and supplications have mercy upon us all and save us for the sake of your holy name, which is called upon us. Recite the names of the Holy Father, the Matrifor of all in our sleep. O Lord, all the souls. And forgive us our sins. May their holy blessing be with us. Amen. Glory to you, O Lord, Lord, have mercy. Sarufim Dawood Hanna, Wabrahim Ramzi Sana, Philip Jolid Zaki, Farag Iskander, Tafadal Yarab, and Tunayah Nafsabin, and Musalat Rahamat, Al Amba Bisinti, Kiriel Aisun, Remember Ulu. Oh, 
of the faithful oh, we have remembered those of the orthodox we have not remember them and us as the good and lover of mankind Who 
gave himself up for our salvation from sin. Through the multitude of his mercies has loaded the enmity of mankind. O the only begotten God, ah, 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 in the bosom of his Father, O Lord, bless us. Because most 
Afti safu immunim binomus Nemni yentu liyetiz khiyyut Khim bi evangeliyun et uwev Allamna nasum wa salam هما اللذان يخرجان الشياطين قال إن هذا الجنس لا يخرج بشيء إلا بالصلاة والصوم كريالايسون كريالايسون يا which raised Elijah to heaven and saved Daniel from the lion den. Fasting and prayer are those which Moses pursued until he received the new commandments written with the finger of God. Fasting and prayer are those which genuinely pursued God. Had mercy on them, forgive them their sins. Lifted his wrath away from them. Kyrie Eleison, Kyrie Prophet is a hoven hate a very prophet of in it. Vibgen in be Christos Hago fem bevgeni can on mission go fasting and prayers are those which the apostle perso they preach. To all nations, make them Christian, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Fasting and prayer are those which the martyr pursued until they shed their blood. For the name of Christ's sake, who confessed the good confession before Pontius Pilate. Fasting and prayer are those which the righteous, just, and cross bearer pursued, dwelt in mountain desert, whole of the earth, because of their holy love for Christ the King. Assum wa sala Hum al-lathan y'amila bihim al-abrar Wa al-siddiqun wa lubbas al-salib Sakanu al-gibal wa al-barari wa shukuq al-ardi من أجل عظم محبتهم في الملك المسيحي. نتقدم لهذه الزبيحة المقدسة ونتناول منها بشكر We too let us fast from all evil In purity and in righteousness Let us proceed forth to this holy sacrifice 
but take of it with thanksgiving with pure heart, enlightened soul, an ashamed faith, a faith and fake, perfect love and a firm hope. May dare with boldness without fear to cry to the Holy Father in heaven, say, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those trespassing against us. And lead us on temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. In Christ Jesus our Lord, for thy kingdom, power, the glory forever. Amen. In the Christ, Oh, and place them. Amen, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. The Holy is for the Holy. Blessed be Lord Jesus Christ, Son of living God. Sanctification is by Holy Spirit. Amen. One is the Holy Father, one is the Holy Son, one is the Holy Spirit. Christ to you to Amen. Amen. Muqaddasun wa kareem gasad wa dam haqiqi li Yesuh al-Masih ibn ilahina Amen. The true precious blood of Emmanuel, our God, this is true. Amen. to the last breath this is life giving flesh your only begotten son lord god savior king jesus christ too from our lady lady of us all holy theotokos saint mary made it one with his divinity without mingling without confusion and without alteration 
He confessed a good confession before Pontius Pilate. He made it a tour us upon the holy wood of the cross of his own will for us all. Truly I believe his divinity parted not from his humanity for a single moment nor a twinkling of an eye given for us for salvation remission of sin eternal life to those who partake of him يُعْطَعَنَّ خَلَاصًا غُفْرًا لِخَطَيَانَ حَيَا أَبَدِيَّ لِمَنْ يَتَنَاوَلْ مِنْهُ أُؤْمِنْ I believe تِنَهْتِ جَيْثَيْ تَيْخِلْ أُمِثْمِ أَمِينَ أَمِينْ 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 I believe, I believe, I believe that it is true, I mean, اطلبوا عنا وعن كل المسيحيين الذين قالوا لنا كرام في بيت الرب سلام ومحبة ربنا يسوع المسيح تكون معكم رتلوا بنشيدنا الليل ويا صلوا من أجل التناول باستحقاق من هذه الأسرار المقدسة الطائرة السماية رب إرحام دوكساسي كليا زوكسا Blesses he who comes in the name of the Lord. Jesus Christ fasted for us for days and for nights. to the multitudes of his greatness alleluia. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Yes, who I'm 
Jesus Christ, fasted for us forty days and forty nights. Symbols of joy, Alleluia, Alleluia. Jesus Christ fasted for us forty days and forty nights. Living even a maro is motiro efron. MF Choice Ben Noti Alleluia Jesus Be Christus Ernest Bin Eriegon En Ehmen Ehon Em Ehmen En Egor Soxa Patrick Eyo Ke Ageyo Ebn Mati Alleluia Jesus Be Christus Ernest Bin Ehriyegon En Ehmen Ehon Em Ehmen En Ehmen Ke Nin Ke Ayi Ke Jesus Ehon Aston Ehon Aston
السلام لرجل صلاة السلام لمحب الإله وقابل الخطاب نيوت أفكر اللوت Help to the new Jeremiah of great asceticism Tears and groaning Peniot of Akirillus You were granted Moses' grace Priesthood of Aaron Wisdom of Solomon Peniot of Akirillus Exaltation, our tongues is rejoicing because we have been partaker of your immortal mysteries, Lord, which an eye has not seen and ear heard has to the heart of men. The thing that you God revealed for us, we are the little children of your holy church. Yes, Father, it seemed pleasure in your sight. You are merciful. We thank you, Lord, the Master, lover of mankind, beneficent for our souls, who made us today worthy of your immortal mysteries. Nashkurak, Ya Rabbi, Ya Muhib al Bashar. يا من جعلتنا مستحقين التناول من أسرارك إلى لهية Bow your heads in front of the Lord إحنا رؤوسك Your servant, O Lord, who serve you Entreat your holy name and bow their heads in front of you Dwell, Lord, in them Walk among them Aid them in every good deed Awaken our heart from every vile earthly thought Grant us to live and to think of which pertains to living And to understand the thing that is yours through your only begotten Son, Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ, we and all your people call aloud and say, Have mercy upon us, O God our Savior. <laughs> Amen. Glory and honor, honor and glory to the All Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Angel of this sacrifice, remember us in front of the Lord. He may forgive us our sins. Ya Malak al-Zabih, askurn amam ilahna, yatahannan alayna, wa yashfi al-marda, yarud al-musafirin, yunayih al-amuhat, yakbal sumna wa salatna ala mazbahu al-tahir al-samawi, yukammil ayyam ghurbitna fi salam wa yakfir khatayana, linusabbih ma'al malayka qailin. أمين الليل يا زوج سبتريك يوك أجيب نف ما تكن كأي كستوس وناستون ونن أمين تنوش فولينجو جو بن شوي سيسوس بخرستوس في تفرنست في نهر يجون نهمن إهون مهمن إجور شا إنتف صوت خن النوفي صوت يمون ونعنا كريالي صون كريالي صون كريا فلوجي صون أمين اسمه رو اسمه رو استيما تانيا كوني فولجو إم بي اسمه May God have mercy upon us and shine His face upon us. Lord, save your people, bless your inheritance through the prayer of our mother, the true Queen, Saint Mary, and Saint John the Baptist, Saint Bob Kirillus the Sixth. May their holy blessing, power, and support. Be with us all, Amin. Be a Christos, be noti. Amin, as a shawmi. King of peace, grant us your peace and forgive us our sins. Ya Malik al-Salam, imnahna salamak. Qarrir lina salamak wa aghfir khatayana. Lord, make all of us worthy to pray thankfully. 
Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those trespasses against us. And lead us not to temptation, deliver us from the evil one. In Christ Jesus our Lord, the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. I mean, we are so thankful to God for giving us today to be ready for the Holy Land through having his holy body and his precious blood. And thank him also for giving, to us, to, uh, giving us today to be blessed by the presence of Abuna uh, John from uh, Toledo, Ohio, and Abuna Macarius from St. Mina Carlyle here in Pennsylvania to join us, to bless us, and to give um, Mademoiselle Eleda Bella. And they baptized her and made her officially a full member in the body of the Lord Jesus Christ. So today we're going to do like a procession for her to welcome her. <clears throat> and this is one of, of the great things in our church. Our church gave the full membership in body of Christ not to the adult, but to everyone. Because it is not to what we understand. It is up to his grace and his love. So we welcome Isabella and they give her the name of Marguerite. Marguerite means precious stone. So we are, we are so proud of them, and also we congratulate Andrew and Kelsey for their uh, new uh, uh, baptized uh, uh, Isabella. Now we're gonna give her like procession in the church to welcome her in the body of Christ, and then the fathers will give us the Ologeia. All are welcome to, so, uh, to, to join us in the social hall. Just a reminder that this week we're gonna start the Holy Land. We have our liturgies every Saturday and Sunday as usual, Saturday 8 to 11, Sunday 7 to 9, 15. And we have two extra liturgies starting from this week, Wednesday from 4 to 6, 15 p.m. and Thursday from 11 to 1, 30. You're going to find all our uh, schedule on the Facebook, on the media, on the uh, website of the church. <laughs> Oh. 
जे आखे आख सोते मोर Congratulations now but we're going to take and معلش نحطه بقى بره we're going to spread the ologia in the uh, social hall and all are welcome to join us in the social hall may love of god the father grace of his son the lord jesus the gift of the holy spirit be with you all amen shamam sa please kamelo lna madihat al baba carlos mumkin Oh, 